Hello everyone, you are in Endurance Lazy Lab. In this video I want to give you a quick outlook and show key differences between our top sellers. You can see our 10 watt laser here, 10 watt deluxe and 10 watt plus. Uh, as you know and we already mentioned that many times that we use only Nichia uh, 445 nanometer laser diodes with rated power of 7 up to 8 watt CV power. Uh, we also showed how you can run in impulse mode and the power will be closer to 10 watt but uh, here is not uh, the case of this <laughs> story. So uh, let me tell you a key difference between. So 10 watt is they're actually the same in terms of uh, power output but they have a little bit different design and different application. For example 10 watt is uh, we called it invincible and it's quite a basic uh, version. It has a laser control a board and it has bigger focusing ring uh, bigger focusing rings, three rings at set actually, and uh, yeah, that's that's pretty much it. For 10 watt deluxe, we added a air nozzle, so uh, you can actually connect it with your air pump or air compressor and use it for cutting. And it has laser box version one, and 10 watt uh, plus actually has. Tech cooling. So the only difference between Deluxe and this one is that it has tech cooling that keeps a uh, laser diode really, really cold. So uh, let's talk about uh, the package. So what goes in the package? We always add uh, protective goggles. Um, they go, they go with all with all model. We also add uh, protective gloves, so it's much uh, much better, and uh, I like it to operate the laser in protective with protective gloves. Uh, we also add uh, stickers, uh, business cards, and uh, uh, aluminum aluminum plate for focusing. So this is our black anodized aluminum plate and we send magnet as a gift and stickers and business cards my, my business card so it goes with all package plus we add um, ACDC so power supply it could be different a variety they are all tested most Chinese units they have for example 7 10 watt but in fact they hardly can do two or three so all power supplies ACDC are tested so uh, it could be this model could be a little bit different so but most of them are well well tested also we add uh, uh, we add plugs for different countries so this is American this is UK and Australia and New Zealand and as a basic they have all U European plugs here. Um, another package that I already added here that we send all types of wires and connectors uh, that are mostly compatible with all 3D printers and C routers plus we add some screws so you can uh, you can uh, hook the laser quite easily. For 10 watt plus and 10 watt deluxe we also add a basic mounting brackets that can be actually installed like this or like this so you can quite easily hook it to like L mount, we call it L mount, this is Russian P, Russian P mount. So you can actually uh, screw it like this and attach to your CNC machine or like this or you can do like a combination for example like this or whatever you want so uh, all uh, we have holes here M3 holes and these are bigger for M4 if you want if you plan to install it on a CNC machine CNC frame you can ask us and we can send you this tulip mount it or you can order advanced or not advanced but basic uh, mounting brackets where we have everything everything here in the in the package uh, also you might be a bit concerned when you get uh, a, uh, another inverter 
This inverter is used for uh, increasing voltage from American uh, 110 volts to 220. Because uh, some of our air pumps, um, let me show you an air pump. The air pump is usually uh, is always sent with 10 watt plus. So you always get uh, an air pump, and the air pump uh, requires a uh, stepper, uh, step up converter, AC DC converter. So you need to connect uh, this to your electricity source, and then you you uh, connect with uh, with your air pump. Uh, also, there is a, some sometimes of concern that our customers they don't understand what what this thing we call it splitter the splitter is usually um, we add it to um, to this unit so uh, when you have uh, this plug uh, goes for a fan and tech cooling so you have it uh, like this and you power your laser box. And now you only need one plug for for your AC DC. So it goes like this. So we have a bit of mess here on, on my table. So let me tell you a little bit uh, about laser box and uh, what is here on the business card you get. So you have a name, you have a date of assembling, you have a, a diode voltage that is not measured here but on, on the diode itself and the current. The current is actually you can see here because current is always the same in the entire circuit and you have a laser uh, heat power that we measure with a calorimeter uh, that, that you also know is not calibrated for these wavelengths but it's like an indication so that we can if you have the same calorimeter you would be able to to get the same result and you have a focal range so focal range is a preset up focus focal range from the laser to a surface so if you see it here for example 60 70 centimeters so it means like the here will be approximately if it's 17 70 millimeters uh, 7 centimeters you'll have the best focus that's uh, that's what you need to know also these uh, these things sometimes it's unplugged you just need to plug it like big because sometimes you when people use it for example on engraving or very low low power they don't need this fan to to work if you uh, operate it in low power uh, for engraving for example and the laser is not going to be hot. Uh, another thing that uh, probably you saw on our videos that when you do laser cutting you need the air goes exactly to the place where the laser hits uh, the surface. So make sure this, this thing actually is quite adjustable. Okay, and probably one more thing that I want to highlight that uh, when you have it, the exit here, you can actually easily put it into your compressor. So that's that should work, or you can uh, you can probably glue it or something. So it's uh, just a quite easy easy combination. So that's pretty much it I wanted to share with you. By the way, you saw this uh, nice yellow box. It means that it's a box that you usually get. We send all uh, our best sellers only uh, via DHL Express. Uh, normally it takes uh, three, four, maximum five days to arrive. So it's really, really quickly and you get uh, tracking numbers. We also take care of all paperwork so uh, you would require you would not be required to do any additional um, uh, paperwork on your side um, just the guy from DHL will carefully bring it to you so if you find that the package was open that because uh, customs they decided to open up and inspect so they have this right and that happens uh, from time to time so I think that's pretty much it I wanted to tell you if you need more information about operation of laser box, we have this video on 
our YouTube. Also, we have a video how to use a laser control board. And yes, that's pretty much it I wanted to share with you today. Hope that you like this video. Please share it with your friends and have a wonderful uh, experience with uh, endurance lasers. Have a wonderful engraving and see you soon. Bye-bye.